Hello there. Welcome to our video guide on 10 types of sensors commonly used in industrial and automation applications. Let's see what they are and what's special about them. Photoelectric sensors use light to detect the presence, absence, or distance of objects. They consist of an emitter and a receiver. And when an object interrupts the light beam, it triggers the sensor's output. Photoelectric sensors are versatile and find applications in object detection, counting, and positioning tasks. Proximity sensors detect the presence of objects within a defined range without physical contact. They can use various principles such as inductive, capacitive, or magnetic fields to sense objects. Proximity sensors are widely used in automation, robotics, and assembly line applications for object detection, position sensing, and control purposes. Fiber optical sensors utilize the transmission of light through optical fibers to detect objects. They offer flexibility and can be used in confined spaces or harsh environments. Fiber optical sensors are commonly used in industries like packaging, material handling, and semiconductor manufacturing for presence detection, thickness measurement, and color sensing. Safety light curtains are designed to protect personnel and machinery by creating an invisible barrier of infrared light beams. They detect any interruption in the beams and quickly trigger a safety response, such as stopping a machine's operation. Safety light curtains are vital in safeguarding applications like press brakes, robotic cells, and access control. Magnetic sensors or switches use magnetic fields to detect the presence or absence of objects. They are often used in industrial applications where contactless detection is required, such as door and gate control, position sensing, and automotive applications. Ultrasonic sensors emit high-frequency sound waves and measure the time it takes for the waves to bounce back after hitting an object. This information helps determine the object's distance or presence. Ultrasonic sensors are valuable in applications like liquid level sensing, object detection, and distance measurement. Color sensors, also known as color detectors or color analyzers, are specialized sensors designed to detect and analyze colors in various objects or surfaces. They can accurately identify and measure the color properties of an object, such as its hue, saturation, and brightness. Color sensors find extensive applications in industries such as printing, textiles, automotive, and quality control. They play a crucial role in tasks like color matching, color sorting, and ensuring consistent color output in manufacturing processes. Laser sensors use laser beams to detect objects with high accuracy and speed. They can measure distances, detect small objects, and even capture precise profiles. Laser sensors are commonly employed in robotics, assembly lines, and dimensional measurement tasks. Pressure sensors are designed to measure and monitor pressure levels in various applications. They can detect changes in air, gas, or liquid pressure and provide precise readings. Pressure sensors are used in industries like HVAC, process control, and medical devices, where pressure monitoring is critical. Label sensors are specialized sensors used to detect and read labels or barcodes on various products or packages. They ensure accurate identification, tracking, and sorting of items in industries such as logistics, retail, and pharmaceuticals. Label sensors can quickly scan labels or barcodes, providing valuable data for inventory management and automation processes. In review, these 10 types of sensors play crucial roles in industrial automation and control systems. By understanding their principles and applications, you can select the right sensors for your specific needs. ADO provides many varieties of sensor. Our extensive range of products and services, including sensor technology, are specifically developed and tailored to your unique needs. Visit ADO online shop to browse various sensors and more products in details. And remember to like and subscribe if you found our video helpful. We'll see you until next time.